Hi guys, welcome to Turtleback Trailers. My name is Barry and today we're in the Turtle Hub. We are going to be winterizing the Expedition Series trailer. Keep in mind this tutorial only applies to the Expedition I have here next to me. We're also going to be dumping a lot of the water today so I recommend doing this outside or having a couple of buckets handy. So without further ado, let's get started. First, start at the driver's side main storage compartment door of your trailer. Turn the handle on the ball valve 90 degrees. This will drain all the water out of the 42 gallon water tank. When you do this, the water will come out of the hose located underneath the trailer. Next, open the passenger side main storage compartment door. Locate the black access door. Open the black access door and reach to the back of the water heater. Turn the yellow T-handle knob 90 degrees to turn off the infill to the water heater. On the outside of the passenger side box, locate the black door for the water heater. Open the door and locate the nylon plug in the lower left side of the tank. This plug holds the water in the tank, so when you unplug it, water will start to pour out of the hole. Take your 15 16 inch wrench and remove the nylon plug to drain the six gallon water heater tank. The water will run out and down the side of your trailer. If you don't want that, try using a funnel to divert the water away from your trailer. With both tanks empty, head to the back of the trailer and turn the sink faucet to cold. Head to the driver's side, turn on the main power switch, and then turn on the water pump. Let it run long enough to push remaining water out of the lines. With the water pump still on, turn the sink to hot. Once all the water drains, close the faucet. Head to the front and attach the shower hose to the shower port. At the shower head, turn the screw. This will keep the shower head open, allowing water to run through. Repeat this process with the shower port, turning on cold and letting it drain, turning cold off, then turning hot on and letting it drain. After you are finished, turn the water pump off. Included with your trailer, is a white blowout valve. It will be located in the drawer under the sink at the back of the trailer. Locate the pressurized fill port on the rear of the driver's side box. Open the box and screw the white blowout fitting onto the pressurized fill side. Then open the cold knob on the shower. Make sure the shower hose is attached and is set to open. Also open the cold knob on the sink. Grab your compressor and attach the trigger to the blowout valve. Blow out sink and shower water lines with low pressure compressed air set to 50 psi. Close the cold circuit and open the hot circuit of the shower and sink. Repeat the blowing process, leaving the air compressor plugged in as you blow it with compressed air. Remove the air compressor and unscrew the blowout valve. Head to the front and unscrew the shower hose. And also unscrew the pressure port. Leave the sink faucet, shower knobs, nylon plug and ball valves open until you're ready to fill it back up with water in the spring. After all these steps are completed, you have now successfully winterized your trailer. Congratulations. If you have any questions, feel free to email us, info at turtlebacktrailers.com. Until next time, folks, enjoy your winter.